What is up guys, it's Conrad back with another video and today we are going to be looking at some of the craziest terminal commands for Linux. Enjoy. So this first command just blows all the other ones out of the water in my opinion. And basically what it allows you to do is it allows you to play Star Wars in ASCII text. Now what do I mean by that? I mean someone actually painstakingly looked through the whole entire Star Wars Episode 4 A New Hope movie, looked through all of it, converted it to ASCII text, and now you can display it inside your terminal and watch Star Wars. Now there's no sound obviously, you can um, change it so that you can get color, but this command also works on Windows and Mac computers, not just Linux computers. So let's see what it looks like. Well first, in order to get this, you have to type in the command telnet towel.blinkenlights.nl And remember, all of these commands are in the description, so you can just copy and paste them as you choose. So we'll enter in that command. And you see right here we have a little bit of a Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy reference. And it's pretty slow, so I'm just going to speed up the video just so that you can see that it actually plays Star Wars. And then we'll go to the next command. So as you can see from that last little tidbit, it does actually play Star Wars in full. Now the next one, this is kind of like a troll. And basically what this terminal command is going to allow you to do is it's just going to repeat a line of text over and over again. So yeah, pretty stupid. But basically, you type in yes, and then what you want to have uh, repeated over and over again. So I'll say yes, Conrad is awesome. And if I press enter, it just repeats that forever. So yeah, it's pretty stupid. I mean, maybe it'd be like a cool troll if you just went on your friend's computer, opened up the terminal, and typed in yes, and then something, and then had it on his computer. That might be funny. But otherwise, it's pretty stupid. Okay, so this one is kind of like an anti-Easter egg, and basically, it's using the uh, program Aptitude. So if you don't have Aptitude installed, just do sudo apt-get install Aptitude, and you'll be fine but let's just get into it so first you're just going to type in aptitude moo and it says there are no easter eggs in this program well i don't entirely believe that so i'm going to do aptitude dash v moo and it says there really are no easter eggs in this program still don't believe this guy so i'm going to add another v aptitude dash v v moo didn't I already tell you that there are no Easter eggs in this program? I don't care. I'm just going to keep on attacking this guy. So aptitude dash v v v mu. Stop it. I'm going to add another v because I'm not going to stop it. Okay, okay. If I give you an Easter egg, will you go away? All right, sure. I'll just add another v. All right, you win. And they give us this interesting contraption, whatever the heck this is. So I'm going to add another V to aptitude dash V moo. And it says, what is it? It's an elephant being eaten by a snake, of course. So, yeah, that's how you get aptitude to show you a picture of an elephant getting eaten by a snake. Okay, so this last one is using the cow say command. And there's also a cow think command, but we'll just be using the cow say command. So you may or may not have to install this depending on what version you have of Linux. But basically all you do is type in cow say and then something that you want the cow to say. So I'll say hello. Okay, and then it pops up with a little text cow that says hello. And I can get it to say anything like cow say eat more chicken. And if you don't get that reference, then I feel really bad for you. Um you need help so you can do that you can also do this with the Ghostbusters logo so if I do cow say 
dash f Ghostbusters, I can say our 2016 reboot sucked. And you see it has the Ghostbusters logo saying our 2016 reboot sucked. So yeah, that's pretty much all the cool hidden Easter eggs in this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. If you liked it, make sure to leave a thumbs up down below. Also, click here to subscribe to my channel and click here to watch another related video. You can do this even if you're on mobile. It's a new kind of annotation. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.